Richard Mills had become one of the best and most desirable watch out there and they have some unique pieces which we all know about but they also have some very relatively cheap pieces compared to what you usually see online. So today, let's go and find out the top seven Richard Mule that are potentially, if you do have enough money and have a successful business, potentially you're able to go and purchase at not such a crazy cost like the one you see online. And number one, I wanna go and talk to you about the cheapest watch out there, and this is the RM016 Automatic Winding Extra Flat. It is priced at $60,000 and this Richard Mule RM016 is the most affordable Richard Mule watch. Just because the RM016 costs the least for Richard Mule, it doesn't mean that any less attention has been given to it. This elegant timepiece is a favorite among many for Richard Mule and the RM016 features a sophisticated extra flat case designed that it is own unique look. The Richard Mule RM016 features a thin rectangular case design skeleton dial and a date window at the 7 o'clock position. Mostly known for being the cheapest Richard Mule watch at $60,000, the RM016 is a piece of horological expertise. To produce the case alone, it takes 202 separate machines, operations and over 18 days of adjustment for a single watch. Combine the meticulous and elegant case with the in-house caliber RMAS7 and you'll get yourself an almost one-of-a-kind luxury watch. The caliber RMAS7 for the RM016 has a 55-hour power reserve, 32 jewels, 4 Hz frequency and a Nivarox balance spring. It has an automatic movement has a frequency of 28,800 VPH or 4Hz as we said, it is water resistance up to 30 meters and the case materials are made out of titanium and 316L stainless steels. At the second spot we got a beautiful RM033, an automatic winding extra flat Richard Mule. The RM016 is Richard Mule's first extra flat watch. This watch features the RMXP1 skeleton automatic winding movement that features a platinum rotator. The research and design that went into the RM033, which is at the second cheapest Richard Mule, was tasked with providing an exotic watch that ergonomically fit like a glove. It's safe to say that Richard Mule did just that with this RM33. With a retail price tag of $80,000, the Richard Mule RM033 isn't a cheap watch by any means, but it is considered entry level for the brand. Still, that doesn't mean that Richard Mule compromised at all with the RM033. This watch is housed with a stellar movement, grade 5 titanium, platinum gold, and 316L stainless steel, and a beautiful skeletonized dial. This watch is perfect for buyers who want something unique although and will be a perfect fit on the wrist. As we said, it has a price tag of $80,000, the movement is automatic, the caliber is an RMXP1, it has a 45-hour power reserve, a 21,600 VPH or 3Hz as a frequency, it is 30 meter water resistance, the case material is made out of titanium and 316L stainless steels, and there's a total of 29 jewels in it. Number three, we got the RM028, an automatic winding diver's watch. The RM028 is Richard Mule's second opportunity at providing a high-tech dive watch. This reference is ISO diver compliant with 300 meter water resistance and an undirectional basal. What Richard Mule has done is take this basic requirement and have added all the wonders of modern technology to it. One feature that is missing is an illuminated indicator on the bezel which would render the RM028 useless in low light situation. The classic Richard Mule fashion, they have completely over-engineered the watch but have done so with in grace. The RM028 is a 300 meter rated dive watch that went to unique lengths to earn its dive rating. Its curved tripartite case design has been a unique design to provide precise tension with a high degree of precision around the exterior circumstances of the case. What the RM028 lacks in low light legibility, it makes up for the technology design and uniqueness. 
It comes at a price tag of $82,000, it's an automatic movement, it has an RM AS7 caliber, a power reserve of 55 hours, a frequency of 28,800 VPH, water resistance as we said of 300 meters, and the case material is made out of titanium and stainless steels, and it includes 32 total jewels. At number 4, we got the RM6301 Automatic Winding DZ Hands. The RM6301 Winding DZ Hands get its name from the hidden function of the watch. When you push the crowd in the sapphire dial, rotates counterclockwise, while the hour hands jumps forward at a different speed. This will continue until the crowd is pushed a second time, restoring time back to its original state. At first glance, the Richard Muir RM6301, you'll just notice a beautiful 18K red gold case, skeletonized dial and a quirky align hour markers. Get hands on with this watch and you'll experience something completely different. Although the winding DZ hands function hold no actual meaning function, it does however show the might of a Richard Muir watchmaking capabilities. This one, we're starting to go above the 100k mark and we are looking at a $120,000 price. It's an automatic movement, the caliber is a CRMA3, 50 hours of battery reserve, uh, water resistant up to 30 meter, the case material is 18k red gold which brings mostly the price up and it's a total of 35 jewels. At number 5, we got, in my opinion, my what, my second most liked Richard Muir when it comes to prices as well, and it's the RM055 Retail Price MSRP Manual Winding Bubble Watch. Now, this one is has a retail price of $120,000 and is developed exclusive for Master Champion Baba Watson. The Richard Muir RM055 Bubble Watson is uniquely designed for high velocity movements, worn every weekend by Baba Watson. The RM055 is perfect. Is the perfect 120,000 companion for winning a golf championship. The RM055 is a highly durable watch made of great 5 titanium steel that features a white ATZ coating on the bezel. Powering the RM055 is the RMUL2 automatic tourbillon movement. Combining the movement and construction of this watch, it's not a shock that the RM055 is one of the most popular and well-known Richard Mille watches. Although it is one of the most known watches, it comes at a reasonable price tag for a Richard Mille standard of $120,000 as an automatic movement. The caliber is an RMUL2, it has a 55-hour power reserve. It is 30 meter water resistant, it has a titanium case and it contains 24 jewels. And number 6, we got the Richard Mule RM023 Automatic Winding, which was born from his predecessor, the RM010. This updated version brings a well executed skeletonized dial with its strong case size dimensions. Having skinny Roman numerals are the center feature of this watch and just add to the old uniqueness that the RM023 delivers. The price is at $120,000. The RM023 is considered one of the more affordable Richard Mille watch out there. With a case made of grade 5 titanium steel and powered by the automatic RMA02 movement, the RM023 is easily a grail timepiece for many collectors. As well, it has a water resistance of 30 meters, $120,000 for an automatic movement. And now, the most beautiful Richard Mule, in my opinion, also when it comes to the price, but as well in general, I do like this watch a lot more than other, is the RM6702. Now, this is a beautiful, beautiful watch, and there's a lot of them made for different people, for different sportsmen, and this is a ultralight extra flat Richard Mule. Although not equipped with intriguing complications, the RM6702 is a timepiece that is anything but trivial, as it is perfectly embodied the concept of a sport watch, light, resistant, reliable, studied and designed to excel in every aspect. Born as the natural evolution of the RM6701, the Richard Muir 6702 takes on even more character and improves on its predecessor in several respects. Starting from the outside, the RM typically tunnel case is made of quartz TPT or carbon TPT, 
to composite materials obtained through process studies by Richard Mule itself, which, in addition to being extremely tenacious and at the same time light, give the case a very interesting demas effect. The skeletonized dowel is made starting from a very thin titanium plate only 4 tenths of a millimeter thick. It is then finally worked in order to recall the geometrical and underlying movement. The dial will then be painted and finished by hand. The one that you're seeing on screen is my favorite watch and this is a watch given to Essa Barshim from Qatar, which is a high jumper version and in my opinion the colors, this you know bright red purple, it's absolutely outstanding. We then got one for Charles Leclerc for F1. We got one for also Sebastian Ogier as a world champion rally driver. We got one for Wade Van Nieker, which is an Olympic champion of the 400 meter flat in the 2016 Rio de Janeiro Olympics, which is a also beautiful, my second favorite watch, all green out. And there's another one for the French Alpine skier Alexis Pintrelot, winner of two Olympic silver and one bronze. So this one comes in different version and my preferred one is the one that you see on the screen and in my opinion it is one of the best looking Richard Mule out there. But let me know your preferred Richard Mule down in the comments below so that we can have a nice discussion and I can learn more. If there's anything I did wrong or said wrong, let me know down in the comments below.